Welcome to Education Lifeline. Today we will be solving one step and two step equations. So the first example we have here says W minus 13 equals 24. So when we have an equation like this, we must isolate the variable, which in this case is W. And we need to isolate the variable by getting rid of the negative 13. And to do so, we have to use inverse operations. So the inverse operation of subtraction is addition. So we should add 13. But we can't add 13 to only one side of the equation. We have to add it to the other side as well, so that it still remains an equation. So after adding 13 to both sides, we get W, and the 13s cancel out, equals 24 plus 13 which is 37. And that's our final answer. In this example, here we have t divided by 9 equals negative 4, and we need to isolate the variable t. So since we're dividing, since t is being divided by 9, we need to multiply 9 to get rid of it. And we have to multiply 9 on both sides. And once we do so, we are left with t on the first side, and negative 4 times 9 is negative 36 on the right side. And that would be the final solution. So the last example here is a two-step equation. And we, when we have two-step equations, we have to start with adding or subtracting first, instead of starting with multiplying or dividing. So we need to first subtract 9 from both sides. And once we do so, we get negative 5x on the left hand side, and we get 24 minus 9, which is 15, on the right hand side. Now, since negative 5 is being multiplied to x, we need to divide by negative 5 to isolate the variable. So we're going to divide negative 5 on both sides, and we'll end up getting x on the left side and 15 divided by negative 5 which is negative 3 on the right side. Please like this video and subscribe to Education Lifeline. Be sure to watch our previous videos and check the description below for other helpful resources. Thanks for watching.